Alright, what up people? Welcome back to the channel. Hopping right back into some more Road to the Show. And in the last video, I asked you guys who was my batting stance. Like, I changed my batting stance, and I told you guys to leave a comment below. And there were literally so many comments. There were like almost a thousand comments on that video, which is absolutely insane. And uh, some of you got it right. A lot of you guys got it wrong. So I'm going to show you what it is real quick. Uh, I said it was like some real random guy, live series player. Uh, not really that well known uh, compared to some of the other guys you guys guessed. And it was indeed Scott Scheibler. Uh, I'm so, I, like, I have no idea how some of you got this right. So what I want to do now is change my batting stance again. And I want you guys in the comment section below to, uh, to try to guess who it is. It's going to be another hard one. Like, I was absolutely blown away that someone actually got this right. So, uh, yeah, if you're watching this and you guess Scott Scheibler, insane. Good for you. But uh, I'm going to make this one a lot harder. So, uh, good luck guessing this next one. All right, so the batting stance has now changed. And you guys have got to guess who it is. I'm not giving you any hints. You guys just have to guess. All right. So here we go. And yeah, the Astros, if you guys have not been watching since the beginning of the season, uh, are absolutely killing it. I think we've only lost one game, um, and it was our last game, I think. I think we won six straight, so I think we're 6-1 and one now. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty confident that's what we are right now. And uh, yeah, man, I'm excited to read these comments. Like, you guys have got to try to get another 1,000 comments on this video. So yeah, we're 6-1. Yeah, that last video, I like logged on to see uh, to see some of your guys' guesses. The freaking video literally had more comments than likes i don't think that's ever happened before so let's see if we can do it again all right but i'm not telling you don't like the video let's see if we need a thousand likes and a thousand comments on this video but god dang it i gotta change my batting stance one sec all right so there you go there's the new batting stance good luck good luck and boom oh my god god dang it well we fouled that one off a mile foul 107 miles an hour and yeah dude it's kind of hard switching up batting stance because they are different i mean obviously the pci placement is the most important thing when hitting but uh some batting stances for whatever reason like screw me up some i feel like take longer to swing i don't know what it is but uh hopefully this one works out good for us as we get a base hit all right let's go baby can we go uh like eight for eight in the next two games maybe 12 for 12 in the next three that would be insane we were close i think our biggest uh at bat hitting streak was like eight games or something like that so let's see if we can make it to 10 here bottom of the fourth zero zero still why not crack this thing open with the bomb that center field that ain't going anywhere yep god dang it warning track power surprised nope i'm definitely not god dang it all right well let's see what happens here come on houston get some runs Get some runs. We're down four zip. Oh, my God. All right. Well, so far, so bad. Um, I feel like this batting stance is cursing the team a little bit. Maybe, just maybe, we can hit a two-run bomb here. Then the Astros can come back. Like, dude, they have came back from way bigger deficits. Don't get picked off. Good Lord, bro. Like, literally, I don't get what it is. But this season, I have seen more pickoffs than, uh, like, all the other seasons combined. Like, last episode, there was a game where the guy picked off to first base, like, literally four times in a row. It was ridiculous. A good take. Definitely swung at that one, but for some reason, it didn't count. Okay, well, I like that. I like that. Yeah, hopefully, they had some new bat skins coming out. Like, um, I want to get that new Mother's Day bat skin, the pink bat, but unfortunately, you got to play Conquest, and I just have not had the time to... Wait, he caught that? He makes the catch. Oh my god, what a play. I have no idea how we caught that. But uh, yeah, I just haven't had time to beat that Conquest map. So yeah, that kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, they should be releasing new bat skins soon. Because I definitely want to use them. And oh, that's getting down. That's definitely getting down. Go right fielder. Wow, good range, buddy. Good range. But, yeah, we're definitely losing this game. We're down four runs in the top and in, in the bottom of the ninth now. Unless you get in that bat here. Maybe the bases are loaded. And yeah, not a single person on base. There's no out, so maybe we get something going here for the squad. They can uh, they can get it going as we ground out. Uh, oh, we don't. Well, wow, that's actually a base hit. Wow, okay. Definitely did not think that was going to be a hit. Hit that like an idiot. But, uh, yeah, boys, I am not liking this batting stance at all. Like, I am not a fan of this. Um, yeah, this is brutal. But, yeah, the Mariners lose. Or the Mariners win, obviously. The Astros lose. No surprise there. That was a terrible game. We did end up scoring. But uh, we got the loss. And we don't care about scoring if we freaking lose. So, here we go, Mighty. We need to hit some more bombs, bro. Like, dude, this batting stance is butt cheeks. Like, I'm telling you, bro, I do not like this batting stance. But I feel like the Astros are about to score 700 runs this game in, uh, for payback since the Mariners just, uh, just absolutely destroyed. So, here we go, Mighty. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Drive this ball over the fence. We're finally hitting right-handed. And boom. Gone. Stay fair. 
Stay fair. No, foul ball. God dang it. Yeah, this guy. This guy's like, oh, you suck. Give me that same pitch, bro. Give it to me. We hit that ball 115 miles an hour. Oh, my God. That is fast. That is hit extremely hard, and this ball is gone. Nope. That one's hit even harder, probably. God dang it, dude. Look at how hard we hit that ball. Are you kidding me? How hard was that? How hard was that game? A thousand? That might have been a thousand miles an hour right there. Let's see. Let's see. Randall's up. Yeah, I don't think it's going to show. Freaking rip, dude. Freaking rip, dude. But hey, at least we're winning. 1-0 is good. We just got to get on the winning streak, boys. Like, how do we win six straight and then lose two straight? That is unacceptable, Astros. No way should that happen ever again. All right, let's go. Hopefully, we're up like 10-1 right now. Let's see. Mighty goes up, line out in the first inning. All right, it's still 1-0. Someone's on third base. All right, let's see if we can drive this fool in here. Come on, Mighty. Come on, Mighty. 441 average. Butt cheeks, dude. I am terrible with the batting stance. Oh, my God. This is a terrible idea to do this. Absolutely terrible. Like, bro. Like, I have hit no balls hard except that line drive foul ball I just had. And, uh, well, that ball's hit pretty good. It's a base hit. Like, have I had an extra base hit since changing the, uh, the batting stance? Like, I honestly don't think so. Like, this might be the worst mistake of my career. Like, no joke, dude. I have not hit a double a triple, or a home run in a game and a half. When I'm usually hitting like three or four a game. This is terrible, bro. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to use this batting stance for more than this episode, but I am still curious to see. Oh, my God. What a play. Dudes, are you kidding me? We got to watch that real quick. Dude, that play was amazing. Oh, my God. Like, I know it didn't look like much from that angle, but I'm telling you, this play was insane. Look at this. Mighty goes running out. He's like, oh, God, this ball's getting down. He jumps like an absolute savage and makes the play of his life. Oh, my God. That a baby, Mighty. That a baby, Mighty. All right, now we just got to now we just gotta hit as good as we're fielding. Like, that has never happened in my career where I've actually fielded better than I've hit. So, uh, something's clearly going wrong here. And I think it's a batting stance. So, uh, yeah, like I said, unless something absolutely insane happens here for the, uh, for the remainder of the episode, we're definitely switching batting stance because this thing ain't cutting it. I am not here to hit singles. We actually are up 5-2, which is good. I feel like this is going to be a home run here. Come on, mighty. Oh! Oh, my God, dude. That wasn't even a bad pitch. I just suck. I just freaking suck. Yeah, um, I'm done with this batting stance. I'm done with it. I am going to trade this batting stance for literally any other batting stance. Bro, this is so bad. But it is kind of fun, though, because I want to see if you guys can actually guess who this is. Like, this is going to be a tough one. There's another base hit. Let's go. Why not get base hits when you have 99 power? Oh, my God, bro. That is that is unacceptable, Mighty. Unacceptable. Hopefully we win. Hopefully we get this win. It's only a one-run game. And, hey, we do actually win. That a baby? All right. Well, good job there. I'm glad we won. What happened to another game? Dude, Mighty, please hit a bomb. We have not hit anything but singles. This is so bad, dude. Our slugging percentage is going way down. And when I want to beat Barry Bonds, his home run record, I got to hit more home runs. And I am not doing that at all right now. But uh, whatever. I mean, the season is still young. We got plenty of time left. But yeah, dude, I'm telling you, bro, this batting stance is just butt cheeks. It is a base hit machine. Uh, base hit machine batting stance, I guess. If you're looking for base hits or uh, or lazy fly balls, definitely use this one. Alright, but this is brutal, dude. Let's go, Mighty. Figure it out. Oh, two fielding situations in the first inning? Okay. Okay. Uh, maybe we're going to get all three. I don't think I've gotten all three outs in one inning before, and uh, we have a shot except for the fact that the shortstop is going to catch that ball. Not me. What the F, dude? But here we go. 459. Only six home runs. I've not hit a home run in like three and a half years, it feels like. But this is the F bat. Someone on first base. And boom. Another line out. And another at bat without an extra base hit, dude. Oh, man. This is bad. This is real bad, boys. I'm telling you, dude. Something, something's going on here. And I think it's a batting stance. I really do. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not swinging at the best pitches out there. But some of these pitches are not bad. Like, some of them are very hittable. Come on, Mighty, please. Drive it all runners. All right, we'll try this. Hopefully the bases aren't loaded. And they are. Well, we need to hit a grand slam. And uh, we have not hit one double, one triple, or anything this episode. So uh, this might be impossible. Yes! 
Okay, so maybe that's all we needed was a Grand Slam opportunity. And that ball was crushed, dude. That thing might have actually left uh, left the stadium, dude. I didn't see where it landed. All right, so our seventh home run of the year was a Grand Slam. Okay. Okay, I like it. I like it a lot. I mean, don't get me wrong. I am still definitely changing this batting stance. This batting stance is absolutely terrible. I usually hit way more than one home run in three games. But let's see. Where did that ball go? Did it leave? Wow, it did, dude. God dang. That ball was freaking launched, that baby. But yeah, we're definitely winning this game, though. But yeah, man, this batting stance, like, I feel like changing to this batting stance was absolutely 100% the worst mistake of my career. I mean, it's obviously not that bad. We just hit a grand slam, but uh, I haven't done really anything bad in my whole career. Come on. Oh, no. Dude, we should have made that play. That would have been insane. That would have been two amazing plays in the same game, but unfortunately, we narped out and missed it. But, uh, yeah, Mighty Ghost pretty much done everything, uh, everything in his career, like, incredibly well. But, dude, this, this batting stance is definitely hindering our ability, so we're definitely changing it. So here we go, 6-2. I feel like I've said that we're changing our batting stance at least 100 times this episode. So my bad, but, uh, yeah, what is, what, I, I, I completely lost what I was going to say. I am an idiot. My bad. But here we go. First base, two outs. Why not hit another bomb here? Oh, my God. Terrible swing. That ball was literally in the dirt. I have no idea how I actually made contact on that. So, uh, I guess good job there, Mighty. Way to make the way to make contact. But I need to lay out those pitches. I need to. But I just like hitting. I just like hitting. Do any of you guys actually take pitches uh, in front of the show? Like, I feel like I swing at every pitch. Like, no joke. So let me know. Do you guys actually take pitches? I probably should. I feel like I would be way better. But I just literally can't. But here we go. 6-2. I feel like the Mariners are going to have a big, like, 8th and ninth inning. So we got to capitalize when we're leading. And that is another base hit. Our 875th of the episode. Like, you guys have got to agree with me, right? Like, dude, I have hit so many base hits compared to home runs and doubles that I usually do. And uh, it's kind of ugly. Like, does anyone actually like base hits? I know for sure I don't. Like, who actually like base hits? Not me. So, yeah, guys, what I want to do to end this video is just kind of go through some of these batting stances and see if we can find one that uh, we think we'd absolutely be able to smash the ball with. I mean, there's literally so many batting stances in there. There's some weird ones. There's some normal-looking ones. Like, they're, they are literally all over the place. So if you guys have, like, look at this thing. Is this Jeff Bagwell? No, I don't think so. But uh, yeah, if you guys have any suggestions, like if there's any of these veteran stances, like any of these things, like all-star, legend, prospect, batting stances that are like super weird, let me know because I definitely want to try them out. All right. So make sure you let me know in the comment section below and and uh, we will do another guess the batting stance in the next video. So, yeah, once again, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think my batting stance was in, uh, or for this episode. I'll give you a hint. It was a right-handed hitter, and uh, he played in the AL, okay? I feel like if I give you if he's a legend or a current player, it'll throw it off. So, I'm not telling you that. So, he was a right-handed hitter. And he played in the AL. So good luck guessing that one. But that is probably a good spot to end this video. There's a bunch of content coming out tomorrow for uh, for MLB The Show. So expect something like that on the channel. Obviously, more road to the show. And uh, yeah, man. Uh, like, dude, I'm insane. I, I love this game. I love road to the show. And I cannot wait to post another video. So make sure you guys leave a comment below. Let's see if we can get more comments than likes. But both over a 1,000. That is the goal for this one, boys. I'm out of here. I'll see you guys in the next video. If you enjoyed it, slap the like button. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.